the influence behind the song Ivory, I think, you know what I'm saying? Should be very evident. You know what I'm saying? My baby had my baby. Uh so I made a song about it. And I was just I just wanted to capture because this is the thing, like as you go through life, uh life is just full of moments and I guess as an artist or whatever you wanna call me nowadays. Uh, I just try to capture that as best I can. And I try to capture what's real to me on a regular basis. Um, so this is one of the, this is one of the most powerful things that has happened to me in my life. So I just wanted to be able to capture that uh, via song and, and and give it to the world and uh, to my baby girl uh, when she grow up, she can understand like how much she influenced her daddy. I swear it's hard to know about true love until you feel the essence. And she is light. Everything that's moving that essence. It's hard to know about true love until you feel the essence. Yep, 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 but we're cool. We're cool. So, uh, so, uh, mm -hmm. same thing. Uh, Ooh, that was a good breath. I was about to give you the business right there. <laughs> Started having the idea for uh, recording the song. I wanted to utilize every single one of my resources and relationships. So I hit every uh, singer that's a friend of mine, uh, starting with David Michael White. Um, I hit Luke Whitney. I hit uh, the Tuckers, who are my family. I hit everybody, uh, Madeline, who, who they're, they're all like my family, and. Uh, and I just want this to be like the biggest thing that I've done production wise, song wise, because it just means the absolute most to me. So I wanted to have everybody be a part of it and add their specific talents, whether it's backgrounds and you can hear the vocals up front. I just wanted them uh, to be a part of it as well. And I wanted to capture every essence that I possibly could, because all of them, especially the Velvet Boys, David Michael White, is just his singing uh, and, and his help on uh, arrangements with uh, a lot of the songs is just. Extremely beautiful. Without Dave, man, he is magic. Dave knows it all. Impressive. All those harmonies, I don't see how he hears it all. That's pure comfort and experience right there. We ready? process for me and Nell on this song was like probably one of the most easiest uh probably one of the easiest processes ever is just because we were both in that vein Nell just had her baby not too long ago and I'm we fresh fresh with mine so she was already in that like that vibe or, or, or whatever it is that you want to call it so she was already there um so just giving her my ideas and everything like that it, it, it was very uh I don't, I don't know what the word is. It was very synchronized, I, for lack of better terms, uh, when we uh, sat down. Are y'all ready? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. We stacking that nail, or what we doing? Okay. Yes, you're stacking. You're gonna so do stack. three. You're gonna do three of everything. Okay, let's go. We ready? We rolling. I'm free. That, um, free. I don't think I can do that full voice. Don't hold it out that long. Alright. Alright, baby. 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 Al
I just knew right when I saw her, I was seeing things and I could see the future and I could see a change in the world. I could see it just being way better than I was. Like just flourishing. Just having just a completely different uh, amount of experiences than I had. Uh, just being exposed to way more uh, and way earlier. Uh, it was just a real beautiful feeling. So it was it was absolutely a no. But once I saw her, it was like the song was not just in my in my mind. It was in my heart. It was in my spirit. It was in my my being. It was in whatever. You know what I'm saying, I love my baby. So deep. And now I'm seeing things in I breathe. I breathe. Inside me, I breathe. That's so nice. And she is like killer. My life on the day to day is uh, changed dramatically, but it's for the better. Um, I still get a brother. My baby is finally at a uh, baby fat is finally at a place where she sleeps through the night. Um, but it's just a whole different thing. Like we responsible for another human's life. You know what I'm saying? We responsible for another human's life. Like our whole goal is to like, all right, make sure she don't die. Like make sure she's there alive, she's a happy, healthy, bouncing ball of joy. And she is that. Like she a very like perfect baby. You know what I'm saying? I'm not sure many people can say that I have a perfect baby. She's excellent. She only makes noise when she needs to uh, eat, when she's sleepy, or when she's had a blowout. You know what I'm saying? Because babies do blow their whole back out. With yellow Dijon mustard boo boo, so you know what I'm saying it's it's a beautiful thing. Uh, fatherhood is like beautiful. If somebody told me congratulations on being a father. I told them I've been son and boys for the majority of my life, but it's a beautiful thing to have uh, my first daughter. Praise God.